Tom, on the left side in the aisle, please. Uh, uh, gentlemen, Tom Reed from the, uh, the Athletic. Uh, just can you each address uh, what it's been like playing against LeBron in the last four years and how has he made you guys better players when uh, playing uh, you know, a guy of that stature in the finals each time and how he presses you, how he, you know, he's, he's such a threat? And how it's helped you guys as players? Uh, I think it's you know um, you just re really have to understand you know how how great you have to be because he's always going to give his team a chance you know and if he mess if you mess around um, he can win a game he can win a series and so uh, you know it's very important to kind of always stay on edge you know always try to. You know, be great every time we step on the floor and put our best game out there. Uh, you know, super great talent. Um, you know, obviously, you know, very smart. So, you know, it's it's important to just try to put your best foot out there every time you step on the floor. And Clay, to to follow up on that, um, just playing. What did you guys learn about playing did you, against LeBron in 2016 when you guys were up three one? A lot of people thought you had the series what you saw in him and how has that changed the way you guys have played against him? Uh, well, he, he literally does everything out there, whether it's play point guard, push the break, rebound, defend, score. So uh, he's probably the hardest guy to lead the game plan for. Not probably he is. And um, just learn, you can never count him out. You know, we were, these last two years, we were able to draw back on uh, our experiences. And um, oh, that's funny, guys. And, uh, <laughs> And, uh, yeah, that's all I got to say about that. Front row on the left. John Dickinson, 95-7, the game. Draymond, for you and, and really for everybody, was there a moment maybe in the Houston series, down 3-2 or, or down at home in game six, down on the road in game seven, was there a moment where any of you guys thought in the heat of everything, hey, the championship may not be attainable or this could end tonight? No, uh, we know what we're capable of. And, you know, I think I thought that, was, you know, that was a moment in that Houston series where we thought we would win 4-1. Uh, you know, and then Andre got hurt and, you know, no one seemed to talk about that loss because we had it all figured out. Uh, they couldn't stop our Hampton Five lineup. And, you know, it was kind of about to be over. And then Andre went down and, you know, we had to figure that out. And so that was never, we, we knew, you know, if we stuck to the game plan and we played our game, that we would win that series. And so, yeah, that. We'll have Kevin, he'll stay a little bit after, he can take some questions after. We'll do the next question right here in the front center. Uh, Draymond, it, it is, how difficult was this particular playoff run, including the regular season? compared to the last three? Uh, extremely difficult. Uh, not just the playoff run, this entire season. Um, you know, you're coming off a championship and you're expected to get back to that level for game one of 82. Like, it's tough. And, you know, he had time where he missed. Kevin, myself, Clay, Steph, Jordan Bell. Like, you name it, guys missed time. And, you know, all the injuries we went through – while going through that grind of trying to get back to this position, uh, it was extremely tough. Um, however, you know, we pride ourselves on our depth, and, you know, at different times in the season, our depth stepped up, um, you know, and even in throughout the playoffs, uh, with Andre going down, Steph starting to, you know, starting to play offs out, like other guys stepped up, and that's what's important. And uh, uh, Clay, how's, how's that ankle feeling? Huh. Huh. I don't even matter at this point. I uh, can't really feel it, but that's okay. Uh, I got all summer to get back, and I was not missing the NBA Finals for nothing. We worked too hard to get to this point, and I was gonna. If, even if I had a broken leg, I was gonna play. Ah, probably not. But, uh, <laughs> I would have tried to play. I keyword tried. I would have tried to play. Thanks. Fifth row towards the center. Yeah, you got steak. You got steak. Just the last one in the center. 
Speedy Marvel from Complex. Draymond, I asked you this yesterday. Uh, Pusha T said, when everything's clicking like Golden State, any of you fellas, do you feel like things were clicking? Back then, like click Golden tonight, State? champ. Straight up. Yeah, it was clicking. I'm upset. <laughs> oh! Man. Definitely upset. <laughs> it says three time champion. It's a three time. Oh, snap! Yeah. Clay just Googled himself. It's a three-time champion already. <laughs> <laughs> That's dope. All right, Slim. All right. I'll see y'all tomorrow somewhere. Thank y'all. Great season.